on my way to Flamingo to meet up with Steve going through Homestead in the big agricultural area. Squash as far as you can see. Corn as far as you can see. So this is what the snake bite no motor zone looks like on a full moon, low tide, northeasterly wind. There should be water in here, but it's all gone. And all the fish that were up on all of these flats earlier have uh, pretty much had to retreat to this main channel which is, I believe, the snake bite canal up through here. There's four or five feet of water. There's little rivulets coming in everywhere. And every time we get close to one of these rivulets, we, we're picking some beautiful redfish. Leaving. Wow, there's, yep, yeah, and this, that whole commotion made more mud around. <laughs> oh, no. That's why you call it an ugly stick, right? Hold it. Hold it. Right here. Right there. Jeez. Right there. We're back in the uh, area around Hell's Bay. They snuck a wiped out a few years ago. And it appears that they're beginning to do much better. We haven't caught any monsters. But we're catching just a bunch of 15 to oh, 20 inches or more. So we're at a confluence of a couple of, a bigger river and a smaller river, and uh, the current's going right down the shoreline. We fished quite a bit of it, we've caught a snook in a couple of points, but this piece right here, they are uh, stacked in here and feeding. The ticket is to try and get it pretty close to the mangroves, and but this fish are out a little further too. Ah, uh, there, there, we got something this time. I may have put this guy on the reel. Do that. Yep, that's a snook. Looks like it. I don't know. It's a snook or a bigger mangrove snapper. I think you have him foul. I don't know, but he's heavy. What have we got? Come right down here. Yep, it may be a big mangrove. It's uh. Redfish, it is. It is. Redfish. Small redfish. You know we're fighting different than what we had. Hole full of everything. Yeah, I'll take the rod. So we found some fish using the spinning rods, and as soon as we caught more than one, we broke out the fly rod. The lox. Yeah. Way to go. Sure. 
That's what's left of a short truce fly that was about that long. Uh, when I finally switched to short truce, I tried some white flies, they just wouldn't hardly touch it, I switched to that, and everybody ate it. We caught trout, snook, redfish, snapper, snapper and a jack on that right here. I'm going to dig out another one. Here's a nice fresh one. We're going to heave out there and see if we can get some more. I think you just thought you just had somebody look at it. Oh, well, we did when it was just drifting. Oh, I saw him. Yeah, I felt them. Oh, there he is. Oh, the nice schnooky. There we go. Yeah. All right, pretty fish. Nice. In the back country, they're not really bright silver like you see outside, but pretty fish. Back are beautiful.